What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a beauty tutorial where I will show you how I achieved this makeup look over here, which was inspired by the Diane von Furstenberg Spring Summer 2016 runway show. So I've had the backstage beauty images from this runway show saved to my Pinterest board for like the longest time. So when Clinique asked me to collaborate on a video for them using the new Jonathan Adler for Clinique makeup collection, I thought now would be the perfect time to finally do this look. Since the collection features a range of bold colors and a few nude and neutral tones in between. So this is a super easy makeup look to achieve and I'm not doing it exactly by the book the way they did it backstage at DVF, but I'm just doing my interpretation of it, which is a little more subtle and muted. So now that's out of the way, let's get into it. So I've already done my brows, foundation, routine, and a light contour with some bronzer. And so I'm gonna go right in with this gold green eyeshadow from the Jonathan Adler for Clinique range in the shade Willow Pop. And I'm going to pat that all over my primed eyelids using a wet, flat eyeshadow brush. It's going to go all over my lid, up to my crease, and then also on the inner corners of my eyes. Then, using an eyeshadow blending brush, I'm just going to buff and blend that in using both circular motions and window wiper motions. Next, I'm going to go in with the shade Aqua Pop, which is also from the same collection, and using the small eyeshadow brush again, I'm going to create a soft shadow line along my lash line, and then I'm going to add a bit of color onto the outer sides of my lids as well. Next, I'm going to buff that in with a bigger blending brush once again. Then using the smaller eyeshadow brush and Aqua Pop once more, I'm going to add some shadow to my lower lash line as well. Then I just want to make sure that the turquoise from the bottom line blends into the outer corner and into that turquoise that's on the outside of my lids. Once that's done, I'm going to apply two coats of Clinique High Impact Extreme Volume Mascara, which basically completes my eye makeup for this look. So now it is time for blush. I am using the Jonathan Adler for Clinique blush in the color Plum Pop and I am applying it with the Jonathan Adler for Clinique blush brush. So when I apply blush, I always smile and then I apply to the apples of my cheeks and then I lightly sweep the color outward so that it all just blends seamlessly. Moving on to lips, I'm going to use the Jonathan Adler for Clinique lipstick in the shade Beige Pop, which I absolutely love. It's got a creamy finish and it is a super pretty pinkish nude. And finally, to complete the look, I am going to use good old petroleum jelly on my cheekbones for a natural highlight. I'm also just going to dab a bit of that onto my lips for a subtly glossy effect. And then that is the final look. So that is it from me for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that you learned something. As always, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Leave me some love in the comment section below and let me know if you wanna see anything else fashion or beauty related and I'll see what I can do for you. Thank you so much for watching and thank you so much to Clinique for making this video possible. I'll see you all next time, guys. Bye.